Spencer wildlife camera to put outside to capture all the birds, squirrels and whatever else might be lurking. Now, what sucks is that we have a small bit of water here, a small lake pond type thing outside of our lodge. So I doubt that the deers would come through at night. Hey everybody and welcome to our fourth and final day here at Centre Park's Longleat Forest. We're here celebrating my incredible daughter turning 13. She only has half a heart so this is an incredible and truly unbelievable milestone to watch her reach. And what a way to start our final day because we woke up to three majestic deer right outside of our bedroom window. We love the footage so much that here is only a sneak peek and we have two separate videos of just the deer alone to watch. So enjoy this vlog and then relax the sounds of nature and its most adorable residents. And don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you in a minute. There's two, there's two. But you're happy to put so much out now. He's right in front of the camera, Pop. Hopefully, camera is good. Oh, he's so beautiful. He's yeah, go on, but make sure that you're quiet. The most magical thing that's ever happened to you. smaller than they look from far away, aren't they? Mm. I can't believe that I checked out all that bird seed and it attracted deers though. Hopefully that camera's picking us up. Hey. Oh, oh, oh my, they're so beautiful. I'm sorry, but how, how are we supposed to leap to start getting ready when there's deers in the yard? Stop, 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 they heard you. Look at those eyes. Eyes, oh. There's one by the lake. Yeah, there's one by the lake. Oh, okay. I want, I would love to try and hand feed them, but I don't want to scare it. No, I think you would. I wonder if the reason that they felt confident to come is because obviously it's check out day for Siri. Oh, oh, you beautiful, beautiful. These no, these are just normal deers. Reindeers only live in that place. 
in here. But, but so can I just say, right, so if you look at his antlers, the things sticking out of his head, mm -hmm. do you see how they're all fluffy? So they probably look soft and squishy, don't they? But they're not. They're rock solid because there's bone underneath. Well, it's not bone, actually, because they shed them. I don't know what it is underneath. Cartilage. Cartil yeah, it might be. But what's crazy is that when the males grow up, that, the fluffy stuff, it's called velvet, it falls off. And there's red dye underneath it. So it looks like they've, they've just, like, bled it off. They are literally right in front. Oh, mm. he's coming back. He's a baby boy. He's a baby boy, Bob. Mm. Oh, we got him early. Don't read for that. Don't yeah, try not to make any sudden... Try not to make any sudden movements because it'll freak him out. But I really hope that camera's picking this up. Hopefully. If not, then at least we have it on this. But, oh my God, if we have it on there as well, then we're literally right in front of them. <laughs> oh, the little doe at the back's a little timid, isn't she? She's like, mm. I know you're there. <laughs> It's so tempting to try and slowly open this window so there's something between us. But, like, an offer of them it from the hand. Like, imagine hand feeding a deer. That wasn't me. I think he fell. What was that? Something spooked him. That wasn't us. Honestly, he fell. He looked at me. He thought it was us. They definitely know that we're here.
workout day and we've had the best last morning because we woke up to four deer right outside of our bedroom window which was amazing what do you think so we ended up waking her up so she could come see them um, well, one, I was very tired, but I think it was worth it. Yeah, so we are going to check out, take the bikes back, and then we're going to spend the rest of the day swimming because you're allowed to stay on site till midnight, but check out is 10 a.m. But yeah, this has just been the best weekend. And Bobby and I always said we would never come back here because it's quite expensive, especially with the activities. But honestly, you don't need the activities. You can just have such a great weekend here, can't you? Yeah, you really can. Like, we lose our spot in the pool, don't we? So, yeah, yeah, I think between the pool and just experiencing the woodlands, that's enough of a break. And it gives you a much more, like, very relaxing holiday feel as well. Whereas at Haven, we've kind of got this itinerary that we're keeping too. So yeah. we don't really get feel, like, very relaxed. It's like, boom, 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 get things done. Whereas this one's, we've been busy, sure, but it still feels really relaxing. What do you think, Donnie? Mm, it's good. 10 out of 10? 10. Yeah? Okay. I'm very tired. She is very tired. Right, we'll see you when we next see you. I don't know when that's going to be, so stay tuned. We'll see you there. Bye. Bye. She just did that. Yeah, it's really good. She. This way. I can't believe she just did that, Bob. Mm, she's amazing. Did you see the control she had as well? Yeah. That was amazing. Alright, gotta walk them in from here, okay? Oh, this way. I knew that. Nine fifty-two. Huh? Nine fifty-eight. What? 
Oh, well, darling, you got the keys for locks? Yeah, they're just here. Right. Would you like us to take the locks off? Uh, no, it's alright. Are you sure? Okay, yeah. thank you so much. Have a nice day. Oh, yeah, it's working. Do you have the key for your lock? Yeah, um, okay. that's Oh, he's got them all? Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I'm so tired. I can't believe what you just did. I'm so proud of you. No, I'm not so in the first Oh, you can choose whatever you want. Honestly, I hope you... Are you proud of yourself? You should be. I'm just wondering. I know. I really... You can never come up before let your head be. Right, we do need to get back to the car, though, because we've got 10 minutes to ask. Well checked out. We don't want to go home. We love it here. Mm -hmm. We want to live here now. We buy Treehouse, live here forever. Okay, <laughs> so we are all checked out. We did have a real struggle though because checkout time and bike return time is both 10 a.m. And because of all the cars, we couldn't ride the bikes. And also, there's hills that you can't push the bikes up anyway, that is too steep, especially for Dorney. Um, so it took us a really long time to get the bikes back. And then it was a mad rush to then get back and chuck all our stuff into the car. Um, so I will say that is definitely some, something to keep in mind. If you can buy bikes and rack them, definitely do that because it's going to make checkout so much easier because uh, it's kind of been a mad rash, rush this morning. Um, and what's even more annoying is that we were on time, but then the deer were there. And I wasn't going to miss my opportunity to watch We deer. just checked our wildlife camera and it picked up a cat, the deer, some birds, and I think that was it more deer and more deer yeah the, it turns out the deer had come first this morning at 3 49 a.m so obviously you would have seen that by now but yeah it was really amazing to see that and to see that it actually worked this time because the first time we set up it did not work so it's a good job that we tested out and sorted all that out but yeah. now we're gonna go and literally spend the entire day swimming so see you later <laughs> bye <laughs>
cover the entire thing. Mm. Right, and again, <laughs> shall I shall I wear it just for content? It's good. Yeah!
We're like majestic seals. There's a slope there, Donny didn't realise, she went, just started walking and went, ah! He came up laughing. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> 
This one? Where? There, behind us. Where? Where? Keep going. Oh no! It's a water extractor. We don't want to. We didn't even get to go bowling, Bob. We didn't even get to go bowling. I know, I don't want to go either. This is like the walk of shame now. It's a shame we can't stay. <laughs> How much do you want to go have a fancy meal right now? <laughs> nice, yummy, fancy meal. <laughs> oh. So you're going to get a roll, a drink, and two other items. A drink? Yep. Yeah. Okay. And then you get to pick two other items. So they've got fruit, they've got Dunkers, they've got Derrily, they've got Baby Bells and Krispies and a chocolate bar. if you want they're meant for babies but and then... oh, of course you're gonna get the chocolate <laughs> yeah gone that's fine yeah. right Bobby what are you gonna get Clearly he wants the baby puree, 100% he wants the baby puree. <laughs> Do you want to be a little baby? 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 Do you want to be a little baby?
Just ham or just cheese? Ham or cheese. Obviously, dairy sandwiches because they are seeds. Mm. Mm. I knew you'd get and that. Then, good on the back of the table. Yeah, and um, then a dream. Let's go, kiddies. Okay. Okay. Right, ready, ready, ready. And. Uh, it's the final. It's the final walk to the car. How are we feeling, Bob? Sad. What was your favourite part of the weekend? Apart from the new team. Working to deer this morning is pretty cool. That was incredible. Honestly, that was incredible. And <gasps> Dog! No, I think having Any particular reason you guys have pushed me into a gutter? <laughs> having a little fun at the, this pool. Yeah, that pool is incredible, isn't it? Best one I've ever been to. And what about you, Don Louise? <laughs> um, all of it really. The pool, the squirrels, the deers, bikes, whatever is on the Yeah, was this a lovely birthday surprise? Yeah. And seeing Don Louise transform, like being really good at cycling and things. Yeah, you've blown us away with both of those, haven't you? You just came um, so much more confident in both of them. And this morning, when you rode past all the people, I was so proud of you, because I bet that was so scary, but you just pushed through it, and I was so proud it of was. you. It was literally like cars, then people. The cars, people, and then people. And I was like, ah. So, Jade Marie, what is your thoughts on, what's your favourite part? So... Coming here might have been the biggest mistake I've ever made because we said it was expensive. We can't afford them to get to the trees. We're never coming back again and we fell in love with the place. So uh, that was slightly problematic because now you can bet we'll be saving all those precious pennies to come back in a couple of years maybe. Um, probably not much sooner than a year or two at the earliest just because it is quite expensive um, even though we came at a downtime. <laughs> But honestly, I don't care that we missed out on any of the activities because I know that we can do that at Haven really cheaply and what they have here we can find elsewhere. Like one of the things that Bobby really wanted to do was the Segway experience, oh. but we can go and do that as just one day out um, by like Virgin Days Out and things like that. Um, and like the aerial course is also as go ape. So there's other places that we can do that. Whereas the swimming pool, there's nothing like that that I know of anywhere in England. And to see, see Dawn, <laughs> to see Dawn, you just like absolutely flourish in riding her bike and absolutely flourish on swimming because those are both things that have been a real struggle. And it wasn't until she was nine that she was actually able to ride a bike because she never had the energy to do it. So to see you just being amazing, that was like the biggest gift of all for me. So it was worth every penny just to see that really. And I'm so proud. Ah! All in all, I've had an incredible weekend. I desperately, desperately want to come back. And if you are kind of come down and you are also over the activities, honestly, just enjoy nature because there's some nature experiences here that you can go to a forest, but you're unlikely to see just because of how busy it normally is. But this is so quiet and peaceful. And I've always loved being in woodland areas compared to the city where I live. So this is just like a massive reset for my mental health as well. Mm -hmm. um, big yawn, but yeah. <laughs> It sucks we've got to go home. I don't want to leave whatsoever. But we've got to go home and that's what makes it fun. But yeah, I really hope that we'll be able to get down in the car without wet feet. Um, <laughs> just wet feet, puddle. Um, I really do hope we'll be able to come back or better yet, explore another centre park elsewhere. Because um, there are obviously more up and down the country. There's one in Ireland and there's one in Paris. So who we London Paris. Um, we yeah. should go there sometime. I apologise to the Irish. <laughs> um, I thought it was Gotland. I apologise to the Scottish also. If you are offended, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, <laughs> what's the answer we have? Me. <laughs> um, and what you just said. <laughs> I'm sorry, my love. Oh, oh. my daughter, sorry. Um, me and my love. Mm -hmm. um, that's the Spanish language. Watch out, love. Oh.
Bob's um, just really so basically I have nothing left to say. If I'm going to keep speaking in this weird BBC reporter on task way because Bobby is having to walk backwards through a car park in the dark and I find it absolutely hilarious. So we're just going to keep walking, we're going to go right past the car and uh, he's just going to have to live with that and maybe we'll just walk all day home, who knows. <laughs> You see this? This is a car. This is a vehicle. This is a mode of transportation taking us away from heaven. Look, I don't even want to see it. <laughs> that wasn't planned. Right. Well, I'm gonna get in the car. And I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna go home now. Yeah, Johnny Pay. I need to get something out the boot though. Leggings. Yeah, I know exactly. Leggings. That is the end of our stay at Centre Park's Longleat. We hope that you've enjoyed coming along with us and we hope to see you in the next video. Make sure you subscribe and we'll see you later. Bye! Bye. Oh, God, oh my God, I'm on camera. I'm on camera. What am I doing with my life? It's all gone red. I'm filled with dread because we have no footage. But we got a photo of a cat. <laughs> Fancy that. A bit full of low mid. I'm going to eat some pretzels now. Okay, bye! <laughs> Photos, but we don't really have time for it really now, do we? Mm. It's a shame though, it's a perfect mural. Mm. Yeah.